Hey everybody, it's Call Me Adam, and I'm here to interview GQ, JQ about Othello, the remix. Well, clearly, <laughs> I'm not the expert in hip-hop, but these guys are. They're gonna be rapping every answer instead of talking. So Freestyle, freestyle, freestyle rapping. So stick around, because we're gonna interview GQ and JQ about the hit off-Broadway show, Othello, the remix. Hey everybody, it's Adam, live and in person for you. Hey everybody, it's Adam. Wonder who he'll interview. Call me Adam.com. This is the New York premiere of Othello the Remix. That's right. What made now the right time to bring the show to New York? Well, it goes like this. We were sitting around thinking we're not doing piss. You know what would be dope instead of eating this with my fork? We should take our damn show to New York. <laughs> uh, that's kind of how it went. You've taken Shakespeare's Othello and you've turned it into this hip-hop show. Out of all of his work, what made you guys want to focus on Othello? Oh, well, we think all the plays are dope, but this one was commissioned by Shakespeare's Globe in London. And then we were blundering, trying to figure out how to do it a tragedy. So we brought a bunch of comedy to the drama scene, and then we figured it out. And we were like, now this is funny, all right, no doubt. And then the audiences came, and they flocked, and they saw, and we kept it real funny, but we kept it real raw. Yeah, audiences <laughs> only really enjoy half. As much unless they laugh as much as they want to So we gonna haunt you with that comic tragic style that we was born to Born Q Nice That's awesome and I, I have... you get to answer too? I thought we were alternating I was feeling inspired All right, cool <laughs> Freestyle You gotta go with the beat Yeah, nah, yeah, yeah. I, mean, yeah. I, I went with it I love how you guys, you guys definitely added a lot of comedy to the show Cause I mean, Othello yeah. typically is, is a tragedy Yeah So I love that there was parts to laugh yeah. So the show is also about love, jealousy, and revenge. So my question to you guys is, when have you each been in love? Uh, when have you been jealous of each other? And when have you, been, have you wanted to get revenge on each other? <laughs> wow. That's love, awesome. jealousy, revenge? Yeah. OK, so yeah. when have we been in love? OK, go ahead. Okay, let's see. The first time I was in love, I was 16 years old in high school. I had my license. I met this girl, her name was Carrie Flood. I was kind of frightened. Yeah, but she had a nice one. And I just wanted to get spice, son. Uh huh, that's right, y'all. I did fall in love. I thought I was gonna be with her above all else. Till the end of my life, I swear to God, I thought she was gonna be my wife. But when she broke my heart, that was over. Since that day, I never once been sober or in love. Swear to God, but this life fits me like a glove. I'm kinda odd. Yes, yes, that's true. A love in my life. It, it, four years ago, I got a wife. I got married. Now we got two little kids. So love gets redefined every moment that I live with them. And it's so beautiful. Plus, we keep the musical. What's the next thing we got to do? It depends. I think it was something about revenge. Um, so when did I want to get revenge on you? Man, never. He down with Family Q. We ain't never got revenge or been jealous of each other. You know why? Because he is me and I am him and he's my brother. That's right, JQ and G, our fellas. I never once felt revenge or jealous about you, for you, of anything you do. Because what he do is mine. That's how we get down. That's why we rhyme. That's why what we do is fine. It's because we just see something else. And we be exactly what we were born to be Put on this earth, make it our turf Gotta thank mom and dad for the birth of us And the way they raised us They taught us, they said we'll save us If we love each other And that's what we got, that's all I got My rhymes ain't hot right now, that's okay <laughs> This is like the most fun I've had in an interview This is great Oh my gosh, so now you have to tell people Why they should come see Othello the Remix Great, go 
If you want to see the coolest and the strangest And you want to see about a million costume changes If you want to see the funniest stuff you ever seen I mean there ain't an ensemble that is really this mean Nobody auditioned for this piece, you know what I mean? This is an ensemble, it was written for us, we're a team Yes, we start dancing, we're moving, we're acting, we're rapping, we got scratching Ooh, what happened? People watching and they really kind of don't know what to make of it Then they take their booties and they get up and they're shaking it and gyrating i'm like why wow, wait and bring your friends back no doubt come on baby let's do this then sack the quarterback and go get some drinkies come on g tell them what you thinking thinking dope beats make you laugh plus it's clever did we mention it's the best ensemble ever to hit the goddamn earth i just slam first pick up later i don't give a fuck i'm an alligator rap tile of this shit because this is what it is this is showbiz not pizza i'm talking about where it's nice to meet you after the show i just be laughing at yo laughing with yo not at yo for show because we just having fun together and nothing rise above because it all come from a place of love yes we redo stories yes it's it's hop yes it's shakespeare Yo. and no we'll never stop but what we do is simple and plain the cues on this earth to entertain Yo. and that's why you want to see it that's why your son does that's why your daughter does that's why your mom came four times <laughs> when she heard my rhymes <laughs> and then she brought her friends back oh fine no. fine fine we fine we do this i'll be quiet we do this <laughs> Cause it's short. Boom, boom. We do this cause it's hot. Boom, we do boom. this cause it's boom, funny. Boom. And man, we do this shit a lot. Yes, yes, we Never do this for the, the people. We do it not to get paid. We do it for you so you and your date can get laid. I'm saying, and you can get all up in it. And plus, did I mention this shit is only 80 minutes? Man, they got cheap ticks. Look online. I don't even care. We ain't out here trying to get signed. We just having so much fun. And then, then we do the damn play till it's done. Kill her till she's dead. Yeah, there's the Mona. Down, heard what I said. That is why you should come see Othello the remix. Oh my god, that was incredible, you guys. <laughs> Thanks, man. It was no the most fun interview no we've ever had. Good, I'm glad yeah. you no guys one's ever, enjoyed I, it. You didn't even take it as a joke. He's like, all right, let's He's go. Like, every serious. answer in a minute. Yeah. yeah. I just, you know, every. That's our dream is that the world starts speaking. Like, you know, like, you know every, that was all. Pure freestyle, you know? Yeah. Like, just anyone nope. at home. They've got to know. Freestyle. They've got to know. I know. He'll make sure. No, people don't realize, I think, sometimes. They think, like, oh, this cute idea, and then they kind of wrote some stuff. Nothing. No, we didn't know we were going to yeah, run. None of it was so rehearsed. we walked yeah. in. Yeah. You had no idea that I was going to come here and be like, you have to freestyle every single answer. Yeah, yeah. You know? And you had no idea what I was going to ask. It was awesome. So, yeah. Thanks, Adam. Great. Thank you. Just ask anybody who's had them at all the place for the business of show. Call me Adam.com.